Hello, hello, hello everyone. Today's video is probably one of the coolest and most exciting videos I've ever made. And that's because I have some very, very important news. And you guys have seen the thumbnail, but what is going on? Well, it has a lot to do with these two boxes that I got from Royal Infield that says Welcome Kit. But before I tell you on what's in those boxes, let's go for a ride. Um, Pints and Pistons is going on, bike night's happening, and maybe we talk a little bit about what's happening during that ride, and then we're gonna come back at the end of this video, and we're gonna open up these boxes because there's a lot of stuff in there, and potentially might be some, uh, some pipes. Pipes for the Royal, because I know a lot of you guys love the fact that I don't run mufflers on the bike, so maybe, maybe there's something in there. Let's wait. So as you guys know from the title and all that in the previous little clip, I am very, very excited about everything that I'm about to say. Um, this conversation has happened a, a few months ago back at the Chicago Motorcycle Show, um, and it's basically, it spawned out of there. Um, I met someone, I met a few people from the Royal Enfield team, and I showed them photos, they knew, they followed me on my channel, and I was just so excited about you know, my excitement about the brand, and they were excited that I was excited about the brand, you know, how all that works. Um, but this opportunity appeared um, after a few different discussions and, you know, just, you know, a few weeks, few months of just having what, what we could potentially do together and how this could work. And I'm proud to announce that I am going to go through this yellow light. Um, a rail infield ambassador of the U.S. And I'm so damn excited about that because it's so fucking cool. Uh, obviously, like I just said, like, I love this bike. Uh, I've had nothing but fun on it. Um, and I've had so much fun meeting other people who share Royals. I've talked to a few people into actually buying Royals. I've expanded my, my social network to include a bunch of people. Um, the fan following base in India and Brazil um, in Europe all about Royal Enfields is just absolutely crazy and to be part of such like a fun fast growing community is just it's so much fun um, I've seen my name being like thrown around as like a verb. I think it's a verb verb um, Like for Tony motored it means like no exhaust <laughs> Which just is amazing or Bertoni did it. I just I think that's so fucking funny and just so it makes so much sense for me and my family and all of that um we, we kind of just go our own ways of finding a little bit of performance and you probably didn't actually find any performance that way but still kind of cool that it happened um but yeah what's going on so i over the next year will be a royal infield ambassador and i really hope that we can extend it beyond one year that's for sure um and what does that mean well you're gonna be seeing a lot more royal infield content um we got a few boxes that i've already hinted at of stuff that we're going to install on the video on the bike and that means new videos, um, potentially new model release videos, potentially who knows. Um, Royal Enfield in India does some really, really cool trips um, in India. And I would love, 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 love to be able to go on one of those. Um, the idea of like being on Himalayan for two weeks and just like bouncing around the Himalayans, Himalayas, Himalayans, Himalayan mountains. I don't know what the word is I'm looking for, but you know what I mean? Damn, it would just be so freaking cool. Um, I'm going to Royal Enfield, or not Royal Enfield, I'm going to Royal Oak bike night right now, if you guys don't know where I'm going, but that is where I'm going. Um, but yeah, I'm just really excited, guys. Um, this, this video is all over the place, my mind's all over the place, it's been a crazy few weeks, um, but this box showed up this morning, um, and I was so excited to talk about it, and I just had to go out and make this video. Um, because, yeah. Just fucking excited, guys. I don't know. What else? I, I almost want to do... There's so many cool things that I want to do with this bike. And, like, this is giving me that, like, extra push um, to go out and do stuff with it. You know, I've been talking about chopping the rear end off for a while. I need to make sure that, like, I can do that now. Um, I don't want to don't want to get in trouble um but like i have the rear light for it i have a bunch of cool stuff for the bike um maybe i kind of want to learn how to wrap my bike that's a potential i'm into right now um so many people are going to bike night right now i don't even know if that's considered a bike honestly 
Ooh, that little pop. But I'm probably just going to skip ahead a bit. You guys probably don't want to see me go into bike night. Not a lot of stuff going on there right now. Um, I'm kind of late to the game. But let's head home. Let's open some boxes. And let's see... Let's see what kind of goodie package Royal Enfield sent me. All right, guys. Camera set up. Boom, boom. So, object, fun thing number one that we got. Let's try to do this. This is very difficult. Nice big Royal Enfield sweater. Big fan of sweaters. As you guys can tell, the sleeve is already inside the sweater because I might have already worn it. Um, but I had to put it back in the box for the video. That's going over there. What's in, I don't know what these two are. Small boxes. Box one. Box two. Let's see if we can get any hints before we start opening them up. Oh, infilled Fort Gator kit. Dope. Let's open that up and then. What, 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 what? Bar and mirrors, all right. Cool, let's go grab a knife and let's open these up, here. This is my office, you guys know what it looks like. Knife. Look at that, Matt Black Leatherman. I saw this on, I believe his name's Grant Evans, his Instagram account, he's like a photographer for Triumph. He has a Matt Black one and I saw it and now I obviously needed one, so I bought one. And I thought I lost it for a while and I found it again. this knife. So, yeah. Dope. So the actual fork gators, so the black pieces that go around the forks, um, for an idea of how I want to design it for the future. And then some instructions. I don't know if I have to pull. Hmm. Might need some help on that. Or a stand for the bike. Um, to be able to drop that. And then these. These, these are just. These are real nice. They got some chunk to them, some heft. So these are, as you guys can tell. All right, onto the second box. All right, I'm gonna need to put this down. This box is too big. And sit. All right. So here's the moment of uh, moment of glory for I feel like a lot of you. That's it. You guys know what I'm looking at right now. If you know anything about Royal, they have quite an extensive collaboration right now with SNS. And one of my asks for all of this is to get some bufflers, mufflers, bufflers. So I get this out because I know a lot of you guys love the fact that I run my pipe, my bike without mufflers because I love the sound. Just kidding. I know you all hate it. Ugh. So another video, we're gonna do a full install on this and maybe like a, a last goodbye into what it sounds. But what else is in here? Coffee mug. Love a good coffee mug. What is this? A bag? I can't do this one handed, it's very difficult. I'm gonna drop the camera. I'm gonna put those in down. Boom. What is this? Oh, it's a dry bag. Wait, is it a dry bag backpack? Oh, shut the fuck up. This is real interesting. Oh, sick. This is like, might be my new camera solution. Oh, yeah. Cool. Dry bag. What else? Some socks, a bunch of stickers, which who doesn't love a bunch of stickers? Let me know if you guys want some stickers. I'll send some out to you. 
And then these are because my original exhaust that came on the 650, I didn't think I was ever gonna put them back on and I messed up and I got rid of these. Let's do this. Oh no, these aren't what I thought they were. What are these? Gasket silencer. I don't know what a gasket silencer is. Do you guys have any idea what these are? Hmm. Focus. There we go. I don't know what these are. Gasket silencer. Well, I have no idea what a gasket silencer is, so... I thought I'd kick GoPro over. Let me know if you guys know, because I don't. And if not, I'm gonna just call Brianna, or Anna, or see if maybe they have an answer. But I think that's it right now for this video. Today's video has been a lot of fun. Um, I'm gonna probably go try to jump back on the bike for a little bit. Um, it's towards the end of the summer, so I'm trying to get as much riding as I can. I'm super excited for this collaboration, this partnership, being a US ambassador, um, really fucking stoked. And I, I am so ecstatic that I have this opportunity to share my love of my motorcycle, the Continental GT 650 with the rest of you guys over the last year since I bought this bike. And I'm so proud and just, I'm just, I'm beyond excited um, that my love for the bike has gotten the attention of people at Royal Enfield so much to the point where they like offer me this opportunity to, you know, work alongside the brand, bring more attention to such a cool bike um, and such a cool market. So I'm going to go back for a ride. Thanks so much for watching, guys.